Hey y'all, welcome back. I wanted to demonstrate this FSD uh, disengage auto steer speed button. So currently, I'm in a speed limit of 30 zone. And if I were going slower because the road conditions, uh, be it ice, snow, rain, whatever the reason may be, if I had it set to a slower speed and with autopilot set to current speed, not speed limit for its set speed, uh, if I disengage auto steer, watch the max speed. So say I'm coming up to this this thing here and I get uncomfortable and I, I have to disengage, the speed limit jumps, speed limit settings jumps by itself up to the speed limit plus any offset. So I've got high water here. I'm like disengage, ah, and it just speed sped up instead of slowing down. So yes, I can just disengage with the brake and that's fine. But this is a un unintended speed increase. Uh, that caught me off guard whenever we had icy conditions. I'd never noticed it before then. Uh, and so I've been reporting it with every version since 10.8, but so far, uh, no no correction to the bug. So one more time, if I, if I engage auto steer on FSD, this only affects the FSD, and I'm going, say, slower than the speed limit, and for any reason I disengage auto steer but keep traffic wear cruise control engaged, it will automatically jump the speed limit, speed setting up. Even though I have my autopilot settings to current speed, not speed limit. So in no world should it increase this to speed limit of 33 or 30 plus the offset. It should have kept my current speed in all scenarios. But it reset the speed and on top of that, it ignored my settings as far as the set speed settings. 